Hello and welcome back to Hard Reset Info. In this video, I'm going to show you how to set up Samsung Pay on Galaxy A56. Let's begin! First of all, we want to go to the settings and make sure we are logged in into our Samsung account, as any Samsung services require you to be logged in into your Samsung account, otherwise they won't work. Then we want to go and locate our Samsung wallet application. It should be by default in the Samsung folder. So we simply hit it. And now we have to agree uh, to... Uh, we have to continue uh, and we want to also get started uh, with uh, the, the country we are currently in. I'm going to hit uh, continue, don't allow notifications. And now we need to input our current Samsung account password. So let me simply do that. Uh, it shouldn't take long. I hope so, at least. Okay. Um, <laughs> uh, let me try that once again. Okay, I know. Uh, I did... Okay, I forgot the password. Now, it's working. Uh, we can also allow it to make and manage phone calls. Uh, and we'll hit don't allow, so it probably doesn't work. Okay, so you have you need to allow uh, these things. I'm going to allow to notifications. And allow the phone permission. So let's go to the permissions. Let's locate our phone and let's hit allow because otherwise uh, the wallet won't work without this permission. So now we hit continue. And now we can um, create a verification method. I'm not going to get through the fingerprint registration as it takes a while. Uh, I'm going to do a Samsung wallet pin uh, instead. Uh, so, well, let's go with the simple one, two, three, four. Oh, that is so sad. It cannot be in the order like that. So, let's go back and, yeah, let's add a fingerprint. Uh, we'll have to add a pin, a pattern or a password uh, with any kind first. And we simply hit done. Now we can go through the process of regist registering uh, our little finger. So let me quickly do that. It doesn't really take long, it's just a tedious task to do and the fact that this phone is moving constantly is not helping. And that's, that's better now. And after a while, uh, we should have it done. Of course, if you have your fingerprint already registered, uh, then you can just use your already existing fingerprint and you don't have to go through uh, adding a new one. We can enable unlocking with our fingerprint. And now, going back to the Samsung wallet, we can use it to verify uh, our Oh, we have to set a pin anyway to the Samsung wallet. That's pretty sad. And it cannot be 1, 2, 3, 4. Oh. Well, let me go with a little L shape once again. And now, as you can see, we are finally inside the Samsung wallet application. And now all you have to do is just press this big button Add Card. And now we can add whatever we want. As you can see, there are pretty, uh, there are many options to choose from. I can also add hit this plus icon here, but it will take us to the same screen. And if we go through the all, we should see exactly uh, all your wallets right now, right here. I'm going, I'm going to also check for the three dots and the usual settings. Though I don't think there will be anything specifically interesting interested here. 
But yeah, setting up uh, the application is really simple and you really need to just add uh, a custom pin and that's all you need to do. And yeah, that's all for this video. If you found it useful, please remember to like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.